Hey, it's a great day. I'm Mike Current, Energizer, and today is day 140 on the Continental Divide Trail. Yeah. Yeah! So let's do this. So for today, heading into Glacier National Park. Yeah, the last stretch on the Continental Divide Trail. Yeah. Now our daily mileage is dictated by our backcountry permit where the National Park says we are allowed to camp. And as it turns out today, first day, it's gonna be one of the hardest out of the stretch. Gonna have to do about 25 miles. Lots of ups and downs today. Yeah, a lot of elevation. And heavy rucksack to boot. It's all right. This is it. It's gonna be a great day. Is it 99? <laughs> I thought it was like 102. I thought, oh really? Don't bring that negativity into the yeah. conversation. Yeah. Don't bring that triple digit number into the conversation. Bring the triple digit conversation. Very good point. Rain turns aren't zipped if you want them. Zipped. Yeah. yeah. Did you ever send them the map of uh, Mini Glacier? Sun's coming up. That's East Glacier down there. Storm looks like it's going to come in. This is it, Glacier National Park. Heading in, heading up, heading to Canada. Yeah, it's all good. Making my way out the first pass. Got a ways to go. You can see the rain on the other side of the valley. Yeah. I'm over the first big pass, now heading down into the valley. Got a ways to go. Heading back up for the big climb. <laughs> it's all good. Right not far behind. Okay. Big hill.
came from over there. Ooh. Yep, heading that way. Got up to go. <laughs> Which berry? Bill, Bill berries. They're like kind of like blueberries and huckleberries, slightly different flavor. They're the same as the ones. Um, not the same. These are dwarf bilberries. Um, and uh, on the PCT in um, like northern Washington, you get into a bunch of a bunch that look just like this that are cascade bilberries, deliciosum. And I like those better. They're bigger. Um, but these will do in a pinch. I've been looking forward to bilberries this whole trail. Bilberry baggins. We gotta climb up that cliff right there. <laughs> yeah, there's a trail there someplace. Break time. Oh my. heading towards the nicer part yeah. uh, as far as the weather is concerned so <laughs> famous last words I know yeah yep End of the up for the day. Now we go down. Only about Two miles left to campsite. Hoping the weather holds off. It's supposed to be getting to camp. But I just can't stop staring. Kind of the days I hike less, it's like, well, might as well just eat. Yeah. Like So closing out day 140, yeah, great day. Got into Glacier National Park, yeah, first full day. Uh, saw that moose, that was pretty incredible. And MacGyver saw a lynx. It was a lynx or a bobcat. If I can get a copy of the video, I'll overlay it uh, right here. But that was, yeah, that was real special and just uh, incredible views. We wound up doing the 25 miles to our designated campsite as our permit allows. Um, and it wasn't, wasn't as bad as we thought it was gonna be. It actually went pretty smooth. Hey, and, and you saw it, you saw it today in the video 
why I think that going northbound on the Continental Divide Trail is the way to go. You know, after almost five months of trials and, you know, tribulations and troubles and, you know, the, the trail culminates in the grandeur and raw beauty of Glacier National Park. You know, it's it's the fireworks at the end of the journey. It's just absolutely beautiful. Incredible. Yeah. Tomorrow's going to be another tough day. See you then.